And we have more breaking news tonight. A sixth person has now been arrested in connection with the tragedy in Dadeville. Another teenager now in custody. Six suspects accused of shooting into a crowd at a Sweet 16 birthday party, killing four and hurting dozens more. Two of those recently arrested are cousins, Johnny Brown and Willie Brown Jr. Johnny is 20 from Tuskegee. Willie is 19 from Auburn. And tonight, the Tallapoosa County DA confirmed for WSFA 12 News a sixth arrest it is a 15 year old whose name was not released. They now join brothers, 16 year old Travis and 17 year old Tyrese McCullough of Tuskegee, 20 year old Hill, uh, Wilson Hill Jr. of Auburn. All six of these suspects are now charged with reckless murder. WSFA 12 News anchor Rosanna Smith spoke with members of the Dadeville community for reaction. The memorial that's been set up here in front of Mahogany Masterpiece, where that shooting happened, continues to grow. The heartbreak and sadness reaches far beyond Dadeville. Residents in this tight-knit community say they feel some sense of relief with the announcement of multiple arrests. I ask that everybody prays for the whole community, especially the families, and uh, just hope justice is served. I think it's very fortunate that we have the level of professionalism, determination, the tenacity from our law enforcement officials to stay on the case. They've been very disciplined with the amount of information they've shared and that kind of thing, and I'm sure that was for good reason. I think it begins to bring some sense of closure for, for some people. Uh, by beginning to uh, arrest suspects. Law enforcement has still declined to comment about a possible motive or say what kinds of guns were used or how many shots were fired. They are urging anyone who attended the party Saturday night who has not already come forward to speak with them to do so immediately. Rosanna Smith, WSFA 12 News, Dadeville. If you have information or images from that night, you are urged to reach out to authorities. Upload those videos. You can do that with the information you'll find at WSFA.com or on the WSFA 12 News app. You can also call in your tip to Central Alabama Crime Stoppers at 215-STOP. A $5,000 reward is being offered in this case.